Now, in a developing story, the recent launch of Amazon.coza on Tuesday last week made a significant milestone in the country's online retail history with far-reaching implications for the industry. Often referred to as the e-commerce A-bomb, this move is expected to have a profound effect on the sector. In an official statement, the leading global e-commerce company announced the availability of a wide range of local and international brands across 20 product categories with speedy same-day and next-day delivery options, over 3,000 convenient pickup points and a hassle-free return system. Similar to its global operations, a substantial portion of Amazon's inventory in South Africa is anticipated to be sourced from independent sellers, particularly small and medium-sized businesses. E-commerce expert Warwick Kearns weighs in on the matter. What does Amazon's launch mean for local companies and our local economy? Some have been quick to point out that profits made by Amazon will just be sent offshore to international shareholders. But we need to recognize the investment that they've been making into local courier companies, IT businesses and the BE companies which they've committed to uplift. Besides, consumers are already spending millions of rands every single day on websites like Timu and Sheen and that money is just leaving our country immediately and that is detrimental to our economy. So we need to recognize the investment that Amazon is making in our country and we need to recognize that Amazon's launch is possibly one of the biggest and best business opportunities of our lifetime. The biggest e-commerce retailer in the world has opened on our shore and they let us partake in their success. You see here at the Insaka e-commerce academy I've been saying it time and time again that e-commerce is the great equalizer whereby entrepreneurs big and small are able to get involved with selling online and now we can use marketplaces like Amazon to get our products in front of millions of customers straight away.